quick reminder that the appendix could be anywhere in the right lower quadrant, sometimes even in the right upper quadrant. So here you have the common iliac artery, and here's your appendix. And oftentimes the appendix will drape over the common iliac artery. Now something to keep in mind is that the ureter also passes this plane and can be confused appendix. So keep that in mind, especially if there's urothelial thickening, which is edema and thickening of the, of the epithelial lining of the ureter. That won't end. It'll keep on going down into the bladder. So it won't be blind ending and it won't have gut signature. So you won't see all the mucosal layers of the bowel, which is the appendix. So this appendix starts to dip down four millimeters. So it's normal. You can see it starts to dip down further here. You get your psoas muscle here, further down, down, psoas muscle again. And here is pretty deep there. And here is your external iliac artery and internal iliac artery. This appendix is tucked very neatly in between that bifurcation of the common iliac artery. So you got your aorta, common iliac artery, external iliac artery, and internal iliac artery. And here's your appendix there, just chilling. So always keep that in mind. It could be anywhere.